Hey guys, Jack Atalik here. Uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, medyo matagal-tagal na rin yung last video natin na in-upload last time. So, without further ado, ito na. Two latest 5G smartphones from Cherry, Aqua S10 Pro 5G, and Aqua SB. Siyempre, unahin muna natin si Aqua S10 Pro 5G. Bago natin unbox, check natin yung initial specs. Yung full specs, nakapost sa description below. It's running on Android 11 OS. Chipset MTK Dimensity 700 with 2.2 GHz octa-core processor. 6.78 inch Full HD Plus IPS TrueView display. Quad camera at the back, 48MP plus 5MP plus 2MP and 2MP. Front camera, 16MP. Memory, 128GB ROM plus 4GB RAM. Expandable micro SD up to 512GB. And 5000 battery capacity. Other features includes punch hole display, 108MP Super Pixel AI quad camera. 5G support, liquid cooling tech, and 18 watts pass charging support. Okay, right, let's do the unboxing. Aqua S10 Pro 5G smartphone. Quick user guide. Jelly case, fast charger, headset, and USB Type C cable. Next, check natin physically. So, kung familiar kayo sa itsura ni Aqua S10 Pro, itong si Aqua S10 Pro 5G is almost identical in terms of physicality, build, shape, and placement. Ito yung 6.78 inch Full HD punch hole display, 16 MP front camera, top part, left side, volume rocker, SIM and SD card tray, right side, power button, at the same time, side fingerprint scanner, Bottom part, 3.5 audio jack, USB Type-C port, and speaker. At the back, quad camera with main camera, 48MP with flash, and glossy black finish back housing. One last look. Next, check natin software interface. Aqua SN Pro 5G is running on latest Android OS 11. Same sila na user interface ni Aqua S10 Pro. Drop down menu, shortcut settings. Preloaded apps like Google and some utility software apps. So expect no bloatwares on this stock Android OS. In terms of responsiveness, napaka-smooth niya gamitin. Under smartphone settings, syempre, nandito yung connectivity setups like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, mobile network, hotspot, and tethering. And also, meron din siyang Android Auto. Display settings. You can choose from light theme to dark theme. Changing wallpapers, custom home layout, you can customize icons, app name, icon size, and desktop mode. Other settings include navigation bar, sound settings, app sign notification, biometrics and password, security, accounts, and about phone. Under about phone, you can check Android version which is 11 and current build version. Next, check natin camera app. Kung pamilyar ulit kayo sa 
UI ni Aqua SN Pro. So, almost identical silang dalawa in terms of usability and features. Features includes HDR, AI, Night Mode, Pro Mode. You can adjust manually white balance, ISO, exposure, speed, and camera focus. Meron din siyang 108MP, super pixel camera shot. Portrait for bokeh effect or subject isolation, GIF, panorama, slow motion for recording, time lapse, scanner, and macro mode. Next, check natin benchmark and game test.
Okay, so natapos na natin yung unboxing and testing natin dito kay Aqua S10 Pro 5G. For me, it's a big upgrade in terms of network connectivity itong bagong smartphone ni Cherry. Dahil sa 5G features niya, which translates to faster data connections, downloads, and browsing speed. In terms of usability and performance, napaka super sulit na nito guys para sa akin. Napakabilis gamitin, napaka-responsive, no lag sa gaming, malino ang camera para sa budget-friendly price. So, hindi ka natalo dito guys. Kung meron kayong question sa Aqua S10 Pro 5G, uh, just let me know. Post nyo lang sa comment section below. Abangan nyo ulit guys yung mga susunod natin unboxing and testing natin ng mga products dito sa channel natin. Sa mga hindi pa nakasubscribe sa channel natin, click nyo lang guys yung subscribe button and bell button para updated kayo sa mga latest unboxing videos natin. Next up, Aqua SB. Okay, thank you.